Grove Music Online is an English language encyclopedia for music that you'll be able to access through the library's website. Sir George Grove started publishing his dictionary in 1879. At that time, it was just a four volume set. But the last time Grove was published in print in 2001, it was in 29 volumes. There are also Grove dictionaries for subtopics within music, including jazz, opera, musical instruments, and American music. Once you do a search in Grove, you'll see the entries are tagged with one of two categories, either biography or subject. Biographical entries are for people, so composers, conductors, performers, scholars, educators, publishers, you name it. Biographical entries contain the article, which discusses the person, and if it's a long one like this for Berlioz, it'll be broken down into sections in the left-hand menu. Composer entries contain works lists, which provide a wide variety of information, including catalog and opus numbers, performance forces, premiere dates and locations, if a composer has a collected edition, how to find a particular work within it, and more. All entries, whether biographical or subject, contain a bibliography, which is a list of sources that were used to write the article, and an expanded list of sources that are just important to the topic of the article. Subject entries are pretty much everything else, so... Terms, genres, and styles. You could say go read the history of the symphony, and for you grad students out there, it's pretty useful when you're studying for comps or quals. There are subject entries for musical instruments, from the pretty ordinary, like the violin, to the less ordinary, like the nose flute. There are even growth subject entries for locations, so you could read the musical history of the city of Paris, and that's pretty cool. Subject entries also have bibliographies, and if it's a long one like this, it'll be organized into sections, much like the article, for easier browsing. In your initial results list, you can toggle back and forth between biography and subject results, and this can be a useful technique if, say, you'd like to see in which subject entries a particular composer is discussed. I get asked two related questions about Grove with some frequency. First, how do I identify the author of a Grove article? And second, how do I cite it? Authors are listed in the box above the left-hand navigation, though you'll need to click on the link to see the entire list of authors if the article is co-authored, which many are. You can also access this information by selecting the Cite button, which is over to the right. Grove provides pre-formatted citations in MLA and Chicago style. To identify the author of a particular section of a co-authored article, scroll to the bottom of that section and you should find the author or author's names listed there. There's more to know about Grove Online, but we've covered a lot of the basics. How to access it, what kind of information it contains, tools like works lists and bibliographies, and of course, how to cite the information that you find. But if you have additional questions about this resource, please add them to the comments below. And in the meantime, the best of luck to you with your research project.